morning, Florence. Good morning, everyone. How are you guys doing today? What a pretty day. Look at this, guys. Blue skies. But well, we've got some construction going on over there. So but, I apologize um, about that. We are going on such an exciting day trip today. Mm -hmm. Now, there's been a place I've always wanted to go to, probably number one on my bucket list. Not just for Italy, for Europe. No, for the world. Oh, for the world. I've always what? wanted to see this place ever since I saw photos, and we're going today. I don't really know how to say the name, but it's like Cinque Terre. Cinque de Terre. Cinque Terre. Cinque Terre. Something Cinque like Terre. That. It's Sinter. like that. You would have seen it before. It's all these colourful houses in Italy. It looks amazing. We're going to go there today. There's three towns we're going to go to. We're trying to get to. five, but we're only going to make it to three, three maybe, maybe four. Just Good. because we want to see it all before the sun goes down. But you know how evil this sun is here in Europe. But yeah, we're going to jump on the train like just now. Go down there and check it out. I'm so excited to see uh -huh. it. I'm so excited. Uh -huh, let's go. For some reason the web said it left at 9.59 and actually it's at 9.53 so we've made it just with a couple of minutes spare. But luckily we left earlier. Alrighty, we just got to a place called La Spezia Central, uh, which is like the main hub if you want to come in from like Pisa or if you want to come in from Florence, you have to come to this main hub. And then the little towns which we're going to go visit all connect from here. We'll see if it's possible to see all of Cinque de Terre, Cinque de Terre <laughs> on a day trip. We found a map. We found a map. So. This is the long coastline that we are hanging out in today called Cinque de Terre. I still don't know how to say it. I'm gonna say. Sinctuary? Okay, that's like a national park. And we're starting here at Monterosso and it goes to all the different points until we end here. So these are the five places that you go to. So it's Monterosso, Venaza, Cornigalia, Manarola, and Rio Mar... Rio Magori or Rio Magori. So those are the five major towns in the national park. And we're gonna make our way down. Two stops left, and we've this just found so a window beautiful. right on the coast. <laughs> How beautiful is that? Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Alrighty, guys, we've arrived in our first town, which is called Venaza, and it is very colorful. And we're just going to go try find the coastline now and work out how to get one of these um, cards that let you go into the national park areas. But um, it is beautiful. ocean to see it we haven't seen the ocean in so long it is so beautiful here uh -huh. um, we just have to wait till two o'clock which is in 15 minutes um, and that is when the information desk reopens so we can get one of the sink sink cards so then you can go along the walking paths because we want to find a nice shot where we can see the city from far away um, but we just need to go grab some cash out grab the card grab something to eat and then we're going to go and do a big explore of this place but look at this so, so beautiful all the people. <laughs> we just decided to explore around and we found this like, where are we even going? It's like I a cave. Okay, so the ticket office opens at 2, but the ATM doesn't open until 2.45. Oh my goodness, we are dying, <laughs> trying to walk to the top of this hill. <laughs> we found a local and we said, we want a good photo spot. He said, this way. So you could be playing games with us. We could get a beautiful shot. We don't know yet. We're not there yet, but even from here, Oh my goodness, this is looking amazing. Alright, local was wrong. 
We came up, but we just keep going higher. But the actual photo spot is down a bit, and I feel like we need the card to get to it. Yeah. We found a photo spot and oh my goodness, it looks amazing. <laughs> so beautiful. I can see why everyone wants to come here. Here it goes. And we've got lift off. Oh my gosh guys that view was incredible and we did take the drone out we crashed it the first time and we thought we'd lost it down a cliff um but luckily it didn't fall down the cliff we actually had to have Stephen hold cleo and cleo went down the cliff a bit to get it back so you doing that or did you stop? i think so i don't know we'll have to see what i got i was a bit worried um we, we just took um did the drone took photos but this cheeky sun is wanting to set on us it's evil so it's getting that really harsh lighting so now we're running back down here as you can see running back down and going to go to the next spot which is Megalo. Wait, is that it, Steve? It's a, it's a, it's the postcard shot. So we're gonna go get our postcard shot, and then whoo, and then we'll see how the lighting goes from there. Go, Steve, go! Look at it, guys. How beautiful. I love how there's flowers along here, even though it's winter now. Beautiful. It smells really nice too. Evil sun. Where are they? They've gone to get some water. Oh, here they are. We're going to, the next stop we're going to is a place called Manarola, which is like the big postcard spot here in Cinque Terre. Um, so just quickly jumping on the train to go and see it now and hopefully the sun is at a good lighting because it's well, being I think cheeky. We're on the west coast because then the sun is going to, it's going to end in the ocean. It's not like we have to watch out for mountains. Or yeah, so true, anything, so that's true. But it is being cheeky. It's not staying up as long as I would like. <laughs> Because from, from Florence, it took three hours to get here, so that's why we didn't have much time to um, And the earliest train time here. left at 10. There was nothing earlier than I 10. know, it was very cheeky. Aww, cute. Alrighty, just got to Manarola. Still got some sun left. Yay. Let's go find this photo spot and hopefully we don't die from the hike up. Wow, how beautiful is that coast? Can't believe it, we're in Cinque Terre. And the sunset is beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> it's so beautiful. Look at that. It's so incredible. amazing. And we have a beautiful sunset. I know we are mean to you, sun. Wow. But that is one pretty sunset. Wow. Easily top five sunset.
have enough sun for one more place. So we're going to go check out a Yamagori. the last town, Rio Magori. Sorry, always doing it wrong. Oh, Italian flag. Yay. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're walking back down our little trail here, right along the water. How beautiful is that? It's so amazing. And then there's our little town. <laughs> I haven't agreed more with the sign than right now. Welcome to paradise. guys we have made it just after sunset to the last stop which is Rio Maggiore oh gosh Rio Maggiore Rio Maggiore Rio Maggiore Rio Maggiore I did it in my and head. again <laughs> it is incredible look at that how cool is that and then the ocean is right here and the sunset is right over there and there is Stevie taking his foldies yeah. so beautiful what an incredible day. We have not eaten yet though because we've been so busy. So we're going to go find some food and we're going to have some dinner here before we catch the train all the way back to Florence. But it has been absolutely beautiful. Incredible. And we had one of the most beautiful sunsets I've ever seen in the world. It's so good. Uh huh. There's much better lighting on this side. Oh, good. <laughs> How pretty go is this? Take some more photos, all right. All right. What's he doing down there? Always trying to find the good shot. Steve, you should go all the way over there. <laughs> this could end amazingly or very badly. Look at him, he's a little spider monkey down there. Oh, can't even see him anymore. Oh, there he is. Oh my gosh, if he falls in that water, it would be so cold. What are you doing, mister? Steven is currently on his mission to get the perfect shot, which has ended up with him he's over there. climbing all the way out. Oh, oh. Where is he? He waved. he waved. Well, I don't know if you can see him, so I'm gonna have to zoom in. And he is. Oh, there's a guy there. Is someone else him. with him there? I didn't even see that guy. It was all camouflage. There he is. There he is. shot. Steve. <laughs> watching the best sunset we've ever seen we're now walking through Rigamori <laughs> looking for some food we're trying to find pizza because we think to end the perfect day is with the perfect meal what your favorite movie and takeaway food This honestly is one of those towns, one of those places you visit when you travel, when you get like bugs, like, I don't know, little butterflies in you from excitement because it's so amazing. We're just exploring this local town and everyone's just walking around pretty much here with the locals. There's like no tourists around. It's incredible. I highly recommend everyone put this on their bucket list. All the food places were closed, so we've just come to a restaurant that isn't open. We bought a few snacks from the grocery store. We've got this view to look at while we wait for the next train to come. But good day? Very good day. One of the best places we've ever seen, I think. Uh -huh. I think so. I think so. And like, even though the photographs really show how cool it is, the best part is walking through the towns and like seeing the buildings tower over you and just the locals. And all the colors. And all the colors. Eating your chip. I'm so hungry. <laughs> eating, what time do we have breakfast? Like <laughs> really early. I'm so hungry. So 
<sighs> we just got home. I'm so pooped. Such an incredible day though. That is one of those, one of the best travel days this year. It was so incredible seeing Sing Tree. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, tomorrow we promise we'll show you Florence. But yeah, thanks for watching guys and we will see you tomorrow. Night guys. Oh my god, Steve, 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 Steve. Don't don't hurt yourself, Cleo. Careful.